Hi, and welcome back to this episode of This Thing. Today we're going to be looking at how to make a contact instrument, uh, specifically a percussion one, so that you can make your own custom drums. Isn't that fun and nice? So I've gone ahead and I've preloaded a contact patch. In fact, it's not even preloaded. It's just been uh, prepped for arrival. Now, you want to open up your contact and you're going to make a new instrument. And if you uh, haven't done this before, you just double click on this side and it creates a new instrument. So you can follow along from there. Uh, click this spanner or wrench, whatever this is. I don't know. I'm a millennial. Then you're going to go to mapping editor and we're going to just drag in some sounds. So we're going to drag in some sounds that I recorded earlier and we're going to make some drums. And because they're drums, we're going to put this on C1, which is usually kick. And uh, let's have a look at the wave. So you can see it's really quiet and it doesn't start quite in the right place. So I'm going to need to just drag all this. Let's make it really loud. So loud, deafeningly loud. And just control the start and end so that it's a nice punch. Let's have a listen. Like. Perfect. Like, 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 like. Really nice. It's a really nice, crisp, clear, powerful, nice, great good sound. Uh, and just so that we have variation, we're going to do the same with a slightly different sample. Nothing selected, as always. Normalize that. Sample loop. Just, you can sort of just kiss it on the waveform. Like, 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 like. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And we're going to then uh, introduce a snare which has already been normalized, so I don't need to normalize it. Check. Perfect. What a nice snare. And as we did before, we're going to have an alternative snare, just just nestled, just nestled, just nestled there. Perfect. Now, we're just going to add some hi-hat on E, which is... Subscribe. Perfect. Subscribe. 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 <laughs> Don't know why it's playing so low. Uh, finally, we're going to import uh, something that's basically pre-baked, but um, will be useful to us later. Subscribe and subscribe. Oh my God, where's that coming from? Um, yes, we're going to import that. Normalize that. Subscribe and subscribe. I. I'm not going to lie, I'm not sure where the low, terrifying voice is coming from. But if you're doing this and following along, don't mind the demons that are interrupting our, our flow. So what I've done already is I've opened up um, this, little, uh, this little window, I don't know. Uh, and I've loaded it with a GM Drums uh, template so that we can like, chat, like, chat, obviously um, put, like, in, put in all these. So like, let's just make a little drum beat. Like... Like let's have that's a like, very like yeah like like and snare Shack. Shack. this is Shack. a powerful drum Shack. beat I'm sure Shack. Shack. and then subscribe great sub <laughs> those just decay there's definitely ways to make sure they don't decay using the ADSR of the uh, contact instrument but for now we're just gonna leave it as it is it will sound a bit weird but then of course it will like subscribe. Shack. like like, <laughs> so, so it's not sounding great, but like, stay with, stay, stay with me. Like, 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 like. I mean, it's very punchy, isn't it? Shack. So let's just double up these sh uh, snares. Shack. 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 Like, like, Shack. like, 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 like. Great, cool. Sub subscribe. I don't think there subscribe. there are enough of these, so I'm just gonna <laughs> subscribe. Like. Like, 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 
Yeah, that's some good. Sh that's some good stuff. Uh, that is some really good stuff. Subscribe. Gonna... Like, 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 like. Of course, you can velocity edit them so that they're um. Like, 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 like. Great. That's that's great. Like, 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 like. Cool. Okay, so we've got ourselves a beat. That's that's really useful. Uh, and it's a beat all just made out of our own own material, which is which is which is really useful. Uh, and what we're going to do now is that we're going to add um, some bass. Yes, yes. Why not? Why not add some bass? I'm just going to go ahead and open up Reactor, which is a synth. No, it's not. Uh, and I'm going to load up this bass track so that we can create some wild bass. Yeah, now you're talking my language, look. Wow. Like, 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 I... That's okay. I mean, this is. Don't want to break my own horn, but this is um, really sounding good and tight, good and very tight. So uh, all of that being said, that we do now want to treat the drums as if they're actual drums, because they are actual drums, Karen. So uh, let's put a bit of dirt there, because always dirty. You know me. Love me some dirt, and. Let's situate them in a home. Let's put, where do we, where do these guys live? That's right, in a room. In this room. Like, 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 like. Okay, 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 okay. I'm getting strong vibes from this uh, of different types of vibe. Mostly strong, like, like. Uh, but the bass uh, needs to be a bit bassier. So what we're going to do is add in a second bass track and just have a different sound so that you can layer up these bass lines. Like, 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 like. Okay, so that's it's particularly fresh now, right now. And we're going to load this up. So it's, the, so it's the same one as before. Um, but this time around, we can change all sorts of things. We can change the type of uh, the type of sort of sampling engine that it uses so that we can have a real fun time. Um, and we can reverse them and we can release trigger and we can add stomp and volume down and we can add this yep yep uh, almost uh we can hit that and we can make it so that it just it's really good and it, yeah yes yes it's really good yeah, it's really good. Okay, um, we're gonna add this in. Like, 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 Wow. Wow. One thing that you might be asking yourself is, hey, I don't own contact. Well, fret not because a lot of things have samplers. So this one, for instance, has th this, which means that you can import samples into this and not into the contact, which you don't own. Uh, and you can import, that's right, most things. Yep. So for instance, I could go ahead and bounce this, bounce is a technical term, into here, and now, 
Now we can play that. Wow, that's amazing. I mean, it sounds beautiful. And it's great. Uh, you can trigger it so that it's. Uh, you could loop it. That's sounding great. Uh, let's just edit some of the effects. So, for instance, the LFO here. Um, we want that really to. <laughs> Great, <laughs> sounding fresh. Okay. Light, 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 light. Okay, cool, 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 cool. But is it fast enough? Huh? Or is it too fast? Okay, I think there's only one more thing to do here. And I think you all know what it is. We've got to make this boy tape. We've got to tape this boy. Oh, we've got to tape this boy to the ground. Because this is a gem. Why <laughs> does it... Hmm. <laughs> And we have it, a winner. Okay, well this tutorial was all about how to use contact instruments and I'm pretty sure that we learned something. I hope. Bye.